In this video, we demonstrate how to configure Hue for LDAP authentication with search binding. We use Cloudera Manager to configure the Hue.ini file. Log on, select the Hue service, then the Configuration tab, and filter by security. For Hue, we recommend that you encrypt your transmissions with LDAP over SSL using the LDAP-S protocol. This slide lists the eight properties required to do so. Those in purple are displayed in Cloudera Manager, and those in gray courier font are the actual properties in Hue.ini. 1. Set the authentication backend to LDAP backend. 2. For LDAP URL, use the LDAP S protocol and append the LDAP S port, which by default is 636. 3. Set LDAP cert to the path of the certificate authority chain file that signs the LDAP server certificate. 4. Set the boolean for LDAP TLS or start TLS to false because we are encrypting with LDAP over SSL. 5. Set the boolean for search bind authentication to true because that's what we're doing here. We are not using direct bind. Next, we enable an optional property to automatically create new users that log into Hue. 6. Set the search base distinguish name, or base DN, to a subtree of your directory information tree. This property defines the scope of our search. 7. Set the user distinguish name, or bind DN, to username at domain. The value of this property changes per bind type, which you'll see in the direct bind video. And finally, 8. Set bind password to the password for the bind DN user. Let's take a quick peek at a new feature in 5.12 that lets you test your LDAP configuration on the fly. Set the test user to any user and the test group to any group. Remember to click Save Changes, then open the action menu, Actions menu and select Test LDAP Configuration. If the test fails, expand the arrows to see the log message. What's great about this feature is that you can quickly see what's wrong with your LDAP configuration without restarting and logging onto Hue. Once it passes, then restart the Hue service. Before we actually do that, let's test settings for search bind with encryption using the Start TLS extension, and then settings with no encryption, which we don't recommend in production, of course. To use LDAP with Start TLS instead of LDAP over SSL, change the URL to the LDAP protocol and use port 389. Also check the box to enable LDAP TLS. We click Test LDAP Configuration, and it passes. Now let's try with no encryption. The only change required is that you disable the Start TLS property, but you can also remove the LDAP certificate, which I forget to do in this video. We test again, and it passes. Let's return to our original LDAP over SSL settings by restoring the LDAP S protocol and port 636. If we had removed the certificate, we would have had to put that back as well. Now let's retest, then restart the Hue service. Here you can see how we are changing Hue.ini. We click Restart, recheck Redeploy Client Configuration, and then click Restart Now. Once it completes, we can log on to Hue itself. In Cloudera Manager, select the Hue service, click Web UI, and here we select the Load Balancer, which is now promoted by default in 5.12. We highly recommend that you always use a Load Balancer for Hue. And here we are, logged on into Hue after being authenticated by the LDAP server with search binding and using LDAP over SSL encryption. For more details on using Hue with LDAP, see the Hue guide in the Cladera documentation set.